So let's talk about cooperating. Seven powerful cooperating secrets that significantly boost your profits. If I have the time, I would want to go through more. There are probably, I would say, 40, 50 of these that I know, but I just picked the best seven that I think are quite important and quite easy to implement to share with you. Is that okay? Yeah, if I had more time, I would, but I, I just, I, we can't do it. We'll be here all night, okay? Cooperating secret number one, appeal to your reader's emotions, not just logic. Appeal to your reader's emotions, not just logic. People buy because of emotions, but they back it up with logic. They justify it with logic. So what's the emotional appeal of what you do? What's the emotional appeal with what you do? Appeal to readers' emotions, not just logic. When I'm talking about emotions, what am I talking about? What do people want? What do people want? Happiness. Happiness, yes. Success, Success yes. Significance. Significance, yes. Lifestyle. Lifestyle, yes. Relationships. Relationships, yes. We should, we call it love, connection, yes. What else? Money. Yes, money, yes. Sex. Sex. Recognition. So those, you notice, all those are what? Emotions, but they're also what? Feelings. Feelings. So that's our primary needs as a human being. So whatever you're selling, it's like, again, going back to a real estate agent, are you just selling a house? What are you actually selling? A home. A home. And what does that mean? A lifestyle. A lifestyle. It's, it's, this is where I'm going to raise my kids. This is going to where I have... You know, I, I, you know, grow up with, you know, grow old with my spouse. This is where I'm going to have my friends over. That's what you're selling. You're not selling a house. House is kitchen, bathroom. There's no emotions. No emotions. So appeal to your readers' emotions, not just logic. So here's an example in that. Uh, it's one of. It's also a control. What what I mean by control? A control. Everybody has one. A control means it's an ad I've been working for many, many, for a long time that the marketer, the copywriter, would try to beat the control, meaning to try to craft an ad to beat the control. This is the, the measurement. This is the piece that has worked over and over and over again. They couldn't do that. That's why it's called control. So it's a control uh, ad in, in the martial art magazine. Now, how many of you are into martial art? A couple of people. Okay. You don't have to be in martial art to understand the ad. I want you to see the emotions. The what? The words. the words the guy's using. So let me. Why are bigger, stronger, taller, and meaner multiple black belt badasses absolutely terrified of challenging this mild, middle aged, and undefeated, no rules cage fighter from Arizona? It's because his amazing, new, simple, and vicious street fighting system, perfected in illegal felony, no rule pit fights allows you to see the mechanism the mechanism pay attention the mechanism allows you to instantly dominate humiliate even experienced black belt opponents no matter how overmatched you are in size strength or skill the fight is over before he can blink best part you can learn it almost overnight even if you're out of shape and have no previous fighting skills at all guaranteed <laughs> okay how you can see the little bit of emotion is going on, yes? A lot, of, a lot of emotional words. Absolutely terrified, undefeated, right? Simple and vicious, amazing. Instantly dominate and humiliate. Not beat, humiliate. Okay? Blink. So you can see that's emotion. That's emotion. Now, I'm not saying that your marketing piece has to, has to have that much hype. I'm not saying that. But I am saying add a little bit of hype. I am saying that. Not hype, I shouldn't say use the word. Add a little bit of excitement and drama to what you're offering. Does that make sense? That helps. 10 times your finances, 10 times your business, 10 times your marketing, 10 times your life. Hit the subscribe button now.